Now, the HSE is investigating pharmacists who've claimed payment for medicines which haven't been dispensed to patients. It's understood several million euro is involved and the HSE is seeking repayment. The Irish Pharmacy Union has insisted that the vast majority of pharmacists are compliant with the rules. The HSE pays over a billion euro a year for drugs dispensed by pharmacists under the state's primary care community drug schemes. RTE News has learned that the executive is investigating pharmacists who have claimed payments for drugs that have not been dispensed to patients. The executive has written to over 1,700 pharmacists, saying that a number of pharmacy inspections have highlighted the problem. It is understood that several million euro was involved and the HSC is seeking repayment. Fianna Fáil said today the HSC must ensure accountability. But it's important that the HSC does a full and thorough investigation to ensure the taxpayers' money is fully refunded. The fact that there's over several million uh, spent and given to pharmacists for, for drugs that they didn't dispense is really worrying in the context of the overall health budget. We've had a supplementary health budget again this year and we're battling for every million, every cent counts. The Irish Pharmacy Union has insisted that the vast majority of pharmacists have been fully compliant. Pharmacies are all subject to inspection all the time and no issue arises. If there are isolated cases where pharmacies have made inappropriate claims, that's not something that we would condone. And obviously it's for the HSE to investigate further and to establish the facts. So far no facts have been established so there's very little to comment on. The HSC says it will not initiate disciplinary procedures or legal action if it can recoup the full cost of money paid out on invalid claims and have voluntary disclosure by the pharmacists concerned. Fergal Bowers, RTE News.